My next guest is a straight-A student from Atlanta, Georgia, who applied to over 40 colleges because she asked them to waive the application fees. Well, she's been accepted to over 30 of those universities <laughs> and has been offered over $1 million in scholarship money. Please welcome high school senior Kayla Willis. Hello, Mr. Harvey. <laughs> I heard that you've accepted a full ride scholarship already. Yes, I will be going to Fisk University in Nashville, Tennessee. Fisk? Yes. I had to go to HBCU. I had to. You had to go to had HBCU. Had to, yes. But let's go back real fast. Were you nervous about applying to the schools? Uh, yes. I feel like every high school senior is, a ner is nervous about applying to schools because you don't know where you're going to end up going. You know, you take these tests and you take um, certain classes to set yourself up for what happens after high school. And unfortunately, I didn't make good SAT scores. It kind of scared me because I was like, okay, I know I have good grades, but are they just gonna let this one test determine of what college I go to? And I didn't want that for myself. So that was my biggest fear. This is really hard for me to take talking to you because you're in high school and you're smarter than me. <laughs> that's, throwing, that's throwing me off a little bit. I don't think I'm smarter than you. I feel like you're a really wise man. Thank you for trying to make me feel better. <laughs> <laughs> What made you decide to ask them to waive the fee? Nobody does that. Because the application fee costs so much, you know? And I didn't want that to be the only thing that was hindering my opportunities. So I decided, well, what would be the easiest way to get in contact with somebody to see if I don't have to pay? So I just called the admissions office, was like, hi, my name is Kayla Willis. How do I not pay for this application? And they told me about the application fee waivers or how you do it. And then I just started doing it. Then I told my classmates and my schoolmates and my friends, like, hey, you know you don't have to spend all this money for it. <laughs> all you have to do is just call. You went viral when you posted this tweet right here. It says, someone said, the whole world needs to know how great you are. Who told you that? My dad, I was going to work, and I was like, do I really want to post this right now? He's like, post what? And I showed him the photo, and he was like, you know, the world needs to know how great you are, so I decided to post it. And this has led to so many opportunities for me to actually tell people my story and give them an insight on how to, be, how to really gravitate and navigate and just go through senior year, because senior year is really hard. And worrying about colleges and college acceptances and scholarships is a Really tough pill to swallow, but to make that pill a little bit smaller, to so go down your throat a little bit easier, and me being the person that help you swallow that pill is really great. Okay. When you meet young people like this, there has to be some great parenting going on somewhere. Your mom is here in the audience. Where is yes. your mom? Just you? Just tell me how you feel about your daughter. <sighs> I am just grateful to God for giving me a wonderful daughter. She has always been very humble, very determined, very hardworking, very level-headed, wonderful child. I just kept telling her to keep doing your hard work, know where your blessings come from, just stay in his grace because there's no limit to what God can do in your life. Yeah, this young lady right here, this is something else going on right here. Cause let me tell you what I heard. They, they told me that you started multiple clubs at your high school and a lot of your messaging is about self-love and giving students a kind of a sense of community. Yes, I'm the founder of a club called Going Against the Grain and we're a social club for minority injustice within the nation and we provide community service for all of our members. Let me ask you this. Do you think politics could be in your future? 
Oh, yes, most definitely. Um, I want to become mayor of Atlanta, Georgia. <laughs> yes. It doesn't stop there because hopefully, and I really do hope, I have a list of everything that I'm going to do to change the United States for the better. Like, I have a whole list of what I'm doing. <laughs> yes. I even have a list for uh, mayor of Atlanta, and then I have another list, just in case I become senator. And then I have another list for president. Everything you imagine is possible. And God puts the life he has for you in your imagination. I got some news for you, though. Can we roll the video? Watch that right there. Hi, Kayla, and congratulations. I'm Atlanta Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms. We are so proud of your academic accomplishments, and I know you will continue to be a great role model during your time in college. I too attended an HBCU and was thrilled to learn that you've chosen Fisk University. You've made us all so very proud, and while the road ahead may not always be easy, know that we are honored to be a part of that great village praying for you and cheering you on. Best wishes and know that the best is yet to come. Now, <laughs> Mayor Bottoms wants to meet you. Oh so while you're in Atlanta, I'm gonna set it up where you go down there and meet with the mayor. We also heard that your siblings got a hold of your laptop and they messed it up. <laughs> so we reached out to our friends at Ting. Mobile, they're a nationwide cell carrier that helps you save money on your phone bill. They were so inspired by your achievements that they wanted to help you write those college papers. So they're gifting you with a brand new laptop. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's your brand new laptop. Thank you. And oh, this is heavy. since Team Mobile shares your belief that you can get the best in life for less, they're also giving you a Motorola Z3 phone and accessories. Oh, wow. Get that. Plus, four years of Ting Mobile service, and that way you can wow. keep in touch with everybody at home. But that's not all. Ting has one more surprise for you. They know how expensive college books and dorm decor can get. So to help you out, they're giving you $5,000. Wow. Give you that. <laughs> Kayla, it was an absolute pleasure to meet you. I think that everything you see in your imagination will eventually come to pass. That's an amazing thing that you've shared with our audience today. So thank you. Hey, to learn more about Team Mobile and how you can start paying for only the talk, text, and data that you actually use, visit SteveTV.com. We'll be right back, folks. Big hand for Kayla, everybody. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're gonna enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.